Hey, what's up, everyone? This is your boy Ashley Gaming. Well, um, if you're trying to record, um, maybe you're trying to record your voice from a Canon DSLR camera. Okay, so even if you try to buy an adapter from Amazon, okay, on Amazon there are a lot of products which will try to bait you. Okay, they'll try to bait you to buy the products, and when you plug it in into a Canon T7. T6, okay, the Canon Rebel T7 or T6, uh, EOS 2000D, EOS 1500D or whatsoever, it will never work, okay, it will never pick up the sound. And obviously, you all know by now, recording directly your voice from the Canon DSLR camera, it is really bad, okay, indeed, it is really trash. This is the right way, trash. All right, so basically what I found, I may have found a solution, okay? The solution is you're gonna use your phone, okay? You're gonna use your iPhone device, as you can see right here. And you're gonna see, you're gonna use a little gadget which I clipped onto my shirt right here. So basically this gadget will pick up my voice and it will transmit it onto the iPhone. And as you can see in the iPhone here, I've plugged a transmitter. It is it is also called a receiver. Okay, it's really plug and play, guys. Okay, it is really plug and play. All you got is to just plug this in, go to voice memo onto the iPhone, hit start recording, clip this onto your shirt, and there is a little button, a switch button. So you gotta press it. You, you'll notice it, it will turn green. Alright, so that means it is working, and now all you have is to press record onto your Canon DSLR camera, or if you have another camera without the audio. Okay, and lastly, guys, what I'm going to show you is so this is how it works, right? Yeah, I'm in the shot. Yes. Um. Well, lastly, what I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna show you is how you're gonna merge these two: the voice and the video recording footage. How you're gonna sync them on PC? Okay, so there's an app which is called Adobe Premiere. Um, yeah, don't worry about that. And yeah, so yeah, well, this was it, guys. This was what I'm I was trying to show you. And this little gadget right here, it is called a wireless lavalier microphone. Okay, it is a wireless lavalier microphone, and it has two packs. Okay, it comes with two, two of them. One so basically you can clip it onto yours and obviously the another one you can give it to a, other person basically when you're interviewing them okay so now let's go to um to the pc and all right and but what i would suggest you is the best way is to upload it to your google drive you you will be able to see drive okay just click the drive and select upload all right so one two three bam it's done uploaded okay uploaded there we already it is already uploaded all right so the next step is um what you need to do is uh hold on give me a second okay so well basically the next step is what you need to do is to download it from your pc uh so you have access to your google drive here so uh you wanna refresh the google drive and you will see a new recording dot ma4 dot 4 ma all right so you're gonna right click on it and select download okay so once it downloaded all right so now since the recording is in as you can see if i do properties on it you you'll see the type of file it is as an m4a file okay m4a all right now most video editors won't recognize this m4a audio audio file okay even adobe premiere pro might have some trouble so what you need to do is you want to convert it into either mp3 or wave all right so to convert it go to this website which is convertico.io okay dot co.io whatever domain they have and just drag and drop this here okay and now just uh here as you can see convert to wave mp3 ogg it has a lot okay it has a lot of 
uh, stuff and when you're ready just hit convert and as you can see give us a minute uploading and it's gonna automatically convert as you can see converting right now it is converting all right and so once it's done all right finish the just click the blue button which is download and if you have a download the file downloaders and click start download otherwise your download will be dropped down here or up there okay depending on your whatever browser you, you're using i'm using google chrome so basically it's gonna sound like this oh okay, yeah right. so in this tutorial i'm gonna show you exactly how you're gonna sync uh your those recordings those video footage and the sound okay so basically what you need to do is to grab whole so let's see i i'll be needing of these these and the final audio okay so i'm gonna import this right here okay all the media has been imported now part one this is part one right so i'm just gonna double click it it's gonna appear right here so next from here i'm just gonna drag this and put it here okay it's gonna look something like this under your timeline all right so basically this is a timeline and now this one the part two has uh audio so i'm gonna drag this but i'm gonna lock this uh i'm gonna lock this the file but because uh, audio quality as you can see the video quality of the part two uh it, it's not great okay it's not great the video okay. quality as because you can I'm see if i'm playing it okay. see this uh audio quality guys uh not audio quality but the video quality is trash okay this the part two so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna lock the audio file and i'm just gonna remove i'm gonna delete this uh footage the part two footage um, I don't need that I'm gonna remove it okay next in part one so in part one there's no audio okay there is no audio in part one so I'm gonna lock the the video footage and I'm just gonna press delete right there next I'm gonna unlock I'm gonna move this back and I'm gonna select all like this I'm right click and I'm gonna synchronize. Hey, how's it going, guys? It's your boy. Voila, guys. Well, if you're not shy, guys, I would like to kill, murder. And now it is synchronized. As you can see, you have to just fix, uh, look at it, a uh, timeline, and figure this out by yourself.